In 2017, Indonesia entered the $1 trillion economy club, one of only 16 countries in the world. A beautiful archipelago with over 17,000 islands, 250 million people and 700 languages. Indonesia is rich in culture and resources. Indonesia interacts with the world in many ways and is a major exporter of energy. In 2018, 33% of its export, or more than 33 billion US dollars, were of mineral fuels and animal and vegetable fats and oils, specifically palm oil. However, palm oil has been criticized for not being very sustainable. Enter Kamiri Sunan, a hardwood tree with tap roots, greener than palm, and yielding vegetable oil, possessing higher productivity per hectare than traditional palm oil. Kamiri Sunan does not compete with palm oil, but complements it in a very sustainable way, allowing for uses in crude oil and biodiesel. Kemiri Sunan produces nuts, and the tree is productive for 75 years. It has high yields and grows where other foodstuff has difficulty growing. It requires less fertilizer and can act as a conservation tree and help to absorb carbon and retain groundwater. It is also poisonous and so does not replace foodstuffs. Since 2012, BAS has already planted more than 600 hectares and transformed what was once non-productive lands into Kemiri Sunan Plantation with good potential. BAS has been in advanced talks to sell crude oil from the first crop within 2019. BAS current operations are focused in Flores, an underdeveloped island that is looking to grow significantly with the 30,000 hectare location permit earmarked for BAS to develop its plantation. In order to achieve its goals, BAS has set up BIS, a plantation management company which is set up as a collaboration with the smallholder farmers of the area in Flores. Under this structure, the farmers own 80% of the plantation company and will benefit greatly from the right planting and maintenance activities. The smallholder farmers are also welcome to work in the company and the plantation, earning a salary in addition to the ownership in the plantation company. Local people who are not landholders are also welcome to work in the company. BAS has also set up a custom-made factory to process the nuts and produce the oil from the Kemiri Sunan nuts. The oil can be sold as industrial oil or can be further refined into biodiesel. Please join us in developing this amazing renewable energy opportunity with positive environmental and social impacts. Keberadaan saya di PT BIS ini ketika saya bergabung selama 6 tahun, saya bisa merasakan perubahan perekonomian keluarga saya dari awal ketika saya jadi petani sawah dan ada perubahan ketika saya bergabung ke PT BIS ini. Sebelumnya lahan-lahan di sini kan lahan-lahan tidur, tidak ada tanaman. Jadi dengan keberadaan PT BIS, bisa bikin lahan yang semacam penghijauan begitu, tapi menghasilkan uang. Fungsi yang besar bagi generasi dan juga bagi Flores umumnya, terutama bagi Nina Manu yang selama ini kita terus terang, banyak sekali pengangguran, dengan adanya PT BIS bisa membantu mengurangi semua itu dan mengatasi semua itu.